Hello guys! Hi. Hi, how are you? Good, I love that I just caught you after you just shot a scene. Together. Yeah. It was a scene, the drawer scene. Yeah, barely... Something gets stuck in the drawer. <laughs> We're not gonna say what. I don't even wanna know what. I don't wanna know what gets stuck in there. <laughs> Always getting stuff stuck in the drawer. Um, it's good that you can Thanks come and hang out coming. with us. Well, of course, thank you. I love, I mean, I think I've been on every season almost. Maybe, That's wicked. Maybe I missed one, but you know, first yeah. time talking to you guys. I know. Uh, hopefully it's But I've been here for five seasons, so. I know. I haven't. What took you so long? I don't know. So what I'm really wondering is, you know, coming off. I've been waiting for you for five seasons. I know. That's the thing. That's what's been happening. When you arrived last year, you were like, she's finally here. <laughs> Aw. Well, I, I, you know, I'm curious, coming off the last season, obviously it ends with quite a, Quite yeah. a boom, I guess we'll say. Is the operative word. Yeah. So, did Chloe make it? <gasps> yeah, I, that's what I'm wondering. I mean, I it, we, we seem to have an answer. Yeah, so um, this could all be flashback, like, or ghost Or I stuff. could be right. her twin sister. Yes. Right. Janice. I hope that's not what it is. Chiloa and Janice. Chiloa and Janice. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> that's an amazing name. Yeah. Uh, no, um, it definitely went out with a bang last year, and I think the fans are, like, in just... Going crazy. Just in chaos, waiting. Amazing yeah. response to the um, finale. Yeah, it was a great finale. Um, the two parters are always really great. Um, yeah, yes, Chloe does make it. We're um, allowed to say that. We know she made it. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm so relieved. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm so relieved. Uh, yeah, Chloe makes it. Um, but it's it's a transition. It's a big curve. Right. Yeah, it's a transition uh. because now you know I've been shot. Things are. A Which is a hard. rite of passage. Everyone's been shot at some point. I'm sure. Yeah, of course. But yet I still am a rookie. Just because you get shot doesn't, there's no special treatment or extra treatment. Extra treatment. Just because you get shot at, the, at work. You can't, don't talk about that. Alright, alright. Anyways, I will say that um, things are a little bit complicated, as I'm sure everybody will and knows. Yes. Uh, I'm waking up to a whole lot of business. There's right. a husband, yeah. there's a boyfriend, yes. I've been shot. So, um, the beginning of the season, Chloe's kind of trying to deal with that and adjust to the you know, things are different now, right? So right. she's adjusting and, and figuring out how this new information and It's all. a brand new world. But it's true. <laughs> yes. Oh, okay. Yes. So also she's not allowed to be like because she's been injured on the job. Right. Very bravely been injured in the line of duty. Uh, we decided to sit her out of the game for a little bit. She's right. on the, yeah, so I have to kind of. Yeah, she's on like the whatever you call it. The, Destiny. The, yeah, she's on the. Yeah, and um, Oliver is. Yeah, I was just gonna say Oliver has been through some tough times as well. It's true. My friend Mike Cram, who was uh, who was our Kevin lovely Ford. Uh, Kevin Ford, um, beat me senseless last year and took me hostage for a little bit. Then my friend saved me. Which you were amazing. Thank you, thank you very much. And then I saved your life. You did. I know I didn't, but it was Missy's character. Yeah, Andy. Part of it. But every time I talk about it, I'm like, Andy didn't know what to do, and I came and saved. He your actually life. throws it down all the time. Like he'll be walking down the hallways and be like, "I saved your life." I know. And you're like, "That's not true." And I'm like, "I know." Uh, so it changes for everybody. You're yeah. stuck in here, and you know what's crazy? Oliver's stuck in here too, because I sure. am now the staff sergeant. Right. By choice, am I forced? You'll have to see. Um, is How he happy he about, about it? That? Yeah. He feels like a rookie again because he's not. Hmm. I mean, he's supposed to be the you know running the show here, right? And that's something new for him. Hmm. It's, it's different one on one when you're running out to a call or you're in a squad car. Right. And that's um, what Oliver's been good at. You're good at yeah, the street, right? And different relationships. And he feels, I guess. Oliver feels like one of the like right. he's truly in his heart a. Well, when you're on the streets, uh, street yeah, when you're on the streets and then all of a sudden you switch and you have to be the boss, it's, yep. it's this mm -hmm. whole thing where like now you don't know how to relate to people in a different way and still be their boss, but it's something yeah. that you're... So we're figuring all that out. I'm a rookie in my own sense and I'm trying to figure out these relationships and stuff like that. Are there going to be some uh, characters who maybe it works out with better than others? I would expect so. You know, it's gonna it, the season will develop as it is, and we're only fifth episode now. Mm -hmm. Right. Um, but it's a big difference for me. Right. You know, some folks that would be willing and open to come hang out with Oliver or chat with Oliver, or just like, hey, we're all part of each other's every day. Right. Now I'm not. I'm up in that 
Right. Yeah, it's, little office. It's, it's interesting because you and our characters are kind of going through the same thing yeah. in different. Hmm. You just know, discovered that right now. Right in this moment. Oh. I yeah. love that. Except I could say, "Go get me a coffee," and she'd have to do it. Where I she, do it. she was <laughs> like, "Here's your coffee," and I'm like, "Thanks, man." <laughs> you would have to do it. I would, but I'd be like, I. But I'd you know what? Like, would I really do that? Yeah. Totally, I would. Yeah, you would. No, but I'm not going to. It's um, yeah, it's. It, we're both trying to figure out our, our new roles and, right. and yeah. um, it's frustrating for Chloe because she's... <laughs> yeah, yes. We know that? Yeah, well we know, but it's it's complicated. He he asked me if if I'm for sure Doug's girlfriend. And this is the thing. I, I think we have a hint of that, don't we? Have we have a hint of yes. that. Except yes. there's, there's Wes. West. We talked about the... <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no, no, I remember that, but do they know that you're for sure his girlfriend? Like, I'm Doug's yes. girlfriend. Yes, they do, okay. but things are complicated Sorry. because They're there's another, there, there's, something's been thrown into the, into the, into the mix. And, and I'm dealing with an well. ex-wife who's bananas. <laughs> we haven't really established that, but she's going to come after Basically me. Basically what you're saying is nice. the same person. She's taking me all the way. And uh, now I have Celery, our lovely Emily Hampshire, yeah. and she'll be back for a couple of big episodes. That's cool. Yeah. What's it like working with Emily? Because oh my God, Emily is. Amazing. She seems amazing. She's I've a interviewed rock star. her before for two. She's a rock star. Emily That's is amazing. incredibly yeah. talented yeah. and extremely beautiful. Oh my God. Yeah. And they make such an adorable couple. But there are a lot of similarities in between your characters because you're both going through these really wacky kind Jeez. of relationship yes. issues and Come on, I'm dating and I'm changes. in love with a witch. It's amazing. And I'm dating someone who I care about very much, and I have a very handsome husband. I, I do right? enjoy Dub's explanation of that. Of that's the husband, I'm the boyfriend. Yeah, right. I love that, that. that was a funny scene. Yeah, yeah, that's very clever. So yeah, the changes are happening. Same with the rest of the cast. I mean, we're all we're all kind of adjusting yeah. to because we're you know uh, uh, actually no we'd say we're picking up where we well, left you off. Have to yes, right. yeah, we're 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 picking up where we left off. So. So you're immediately actually, follows. Instead of just yeah. picking up six months later, right. you're actually watching us transition nice. into this. Like, like a few new, hours later or a couple of days later. Yeah, so you're actually Anything. the audience gets to watch us kind of go through all the like bumble around and kind of trip over things. So yeah. that's it's, cool. It's exciting. Yeah. Yeah. Well, now, there's a weird question, you know, we don't always get to talk about the last season, but here's a good question. You were in a trunk and you were playing Kamatos in a bed for, you know, Quite a few scenes. Yeah. What is that like to be immobilized? Lying for... down acting, man. There's nothing like it. <laughs> uh, but I mean, to be immobilized as an actor. I you am know? like, I've, Chloe and I have the same thing in common. We, we move a lot, and we like we have a lot of energy. We have that in common. Exactly. My <laughs> great thing was you only ever saw me once the trunk was open, so I was able to. Right. I, I had it was tough. I never had to remain motionless. I've been shot and pretended to be up, but that's tough. It's really hard. It's tough. Yeah, the, the hospital stuff was tough also because you have you know there was a scene happening around me and you want to be like I'm okay. But you, or you want to open your eyes and go Oh my God, what's happening? Yeah. Be like Yeah, for sure. You know. It's hard so, to make your face not do anything. Yes. And they're not just going to mold a body to put in the bed for you. You know. No. 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 It was, uh, <laughs> it was for reals. Wow. Yeah. So it's it's going to be exciting to. It's going to be an awesome yeah. season, and we're going really long. We're doing yes. whack of shows. I don't know if that's Isn't that exciting? We say that? I've heard about the 22 episodes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. That is very cool. So I mean, that's a big home. jump. I mean, that's it is. a it's lot a, of story to tell. Yep, it's a whole lot of story to tell. Yeah. From uh, your perspectives, you know, what what uh, you know, what do you want to see in this season? I want to see more Oliver and Chloe stuff. Yes. <laughs> you know, we work we work so well together. And it's just a roll of the dice, right? Like who gets right. to hang out with no, you? Of course. But, we like to, it's fun. We have a lot of hope the writers? Yeah, sometimes, I think this year actually they've done, they've started to uh, partner up people that aren't normally partnered right. up together because yeah. usually we just work with one other person. Um, yeah. And so it's, they've, they've been switching us around. So it's, um, it's new, new personalities mixing with each other. And it's different because, you know, we've been hanging out for a year, but once you get on set and start doing stuff, it's like, you know, Oliver and Chloe are different things. And it's kind of cool to figure that out. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. Well, guys, I can't wait to see it. Thank, Thank you, you very much. Thank you, Andrew. Weekend. Thank I you very much. Excited. All the best for season five. Cheers. Bye, guys. Thank Thanks you. a lot. Bye.